Okay, <laughs> the easiest way to say, of course, is 50 meters. The bullseye is about maybe this big. Uh, the 10 ring, what we're trying to hit is about the size of my pinky nail, and you're trying to hit that every single time. We start off shooting 40 shots in the kneeling position, then we transition to the prone position, we shoot 40 shots in prone, and then we shoot 40 shots in the standing position. We kind of call it the marathon. Uh, the total time limit for the competition is two hours and 45 minutes. Most people take about two hours to two hours and 15. I think really, I don't know if it's something you're trying to prove, but what most people look at three position as, that's the best all around shooter for a rifle shooter. Because the air rifle event, for example, that's only in the standing position. The prone event 50 meter, that's only in the prone position. But three position takes into account all three positions that you can shoot with a rifle. And so whoever has the most mastery of that is kind of the best all around shooter, quote unquote. And so a lot of people look at that as kind of the crown jewel. You start with kneeling and uh, it basically tests how you're able to get in that position, find your balance. Of course, there are a lot of technical aspects. Balance, balance is everything. And then as we move into the prone position, that one really is testing um, how you're able to make the rifle fit your body. Success in prone has to do with shooting in the wind. And so all of the normal basic things that you would do for shooting, aligning your sights correctly, good trigger control, good shot, shot execution, those are all normal. But seeing the wind really well, working with the wind in prone, compensating, that's really what that, that is about. Uh, the standing position, that's an art. It's, it's very technical, but at the same time, very much an art. The how you control your body, that has more to do with controlling your stomach muscles, your, your hip muscles, your, your upper leg muscles, to find the stability in the body and hold still in that position. And of course, it's very strenuous on your back as well. Standing in especially the standing position, when you stand like this, just try standing with your back arched and your elbow on your hip. Just try standing there for an hour or two and see how strenuous it is on your body and how much it starts to hurt in the back. And then once you add a five to six kilo rifle on top of that, it gets tough. And then to try to find the stability to hit something basically the size of my pinky nail almost every time at 50 meters, that's extremely difficult. I mean, it's a small amount of movement. Millimeters make a difference.